Kristen Stampini's Stamp TV Tuesday. So what we're gonna be talking today is about what is a virtual assistant? A virtual assistant is somebody who is working for you, but is not actually in your office. So you don't have to provide office space or a computer for that virtual assistant. So that's awesome. So they can actually be inside the United States or they can be in a different country, depending on what your needs are, as well as depending on what you can afford. But the great thing is, is you actually can run your company with virtual assistants. As long as you don't need somebody in house, you might need somebody to be uh, doing filing and copies and things like that. But everything else actually can be done by a virtual assistant. They're more and more popular today than ever. And they're actually very knowledgeable. And I feel that our virtual assistants are just as good, if not better, than even people in-house that are working for us. They can be your CEOs, they can be your COOs, they can run your social media, they can actually be your administrative assistant, they can be your general assistant, they can do customer service. There's so many things that a virtual assistant can do. And the benefits is that you don't have to have office space and pay for office space for an assistant, as well as, of course, you don't have to pay for a computer for them. So virtual assistants can also do things such as accounting, they can be bookkeeping, they can do tracking. There's so many different things that a virtual assistant can do for you. So if you are doing anything that is not dollar productive, I highly recommend that you actually look into a virtual assistant. And where do you start at what they can actually do for you? I would literally, every single day for a week, write down everything that you're doing every single day. And then figure out, do I really need to be doing this or can assistant be doing it? And how I figured it out is, am I, is this actually something that is making me money? Am I working on something that's making me money or am I solving big issues, okay? And if I'm not, then I shouldn't be doing it. So once I stop doing the things that I shouldn't be doing, my business doubled every single year for many, many years. So a lot of people say, well, you know what? I can't afford it. You can't not afford it. You have to look at the future and you have to look and see and say, where do I want my business to be? Where is it going? Not where am I today, but what do I want and what do I need to help me get there? Leveraging people is definitely what I have found to help my business grow the most. So if you haven't looked at a virtual assistant, you definitely should. You can actually hire them yourself and uh, put together a hiring process. I have lots of videos on different things to help you, or you can hire them through a company and that's completely up to you. Hopefully today, I gave you a couple tips on virtual assistants. Follow me for more tips every single week. Like, comment, and hit that bell icon. Bye.